If you guys want to buy some cheap MSN or PSN codes and other gaming related stuff, check out G2A.com, support my channel by using the link in the description. Hey guys, how's it going and it is S2G and welcome to the final episode of this series in which we will be playing against Bayern Munich, the finals of the Champions League and you know, come getting here was very tough, we had to beat Arsenal 3-2 on aggregate, then Juventus 2-0 and we went through on away goals and also Benfica who we drew 2 all on aggregate but you know through penalties I think it was 3-1 and we went through and now we are here against Bayern Munich and obviously Bayern had to face some tough teams they faced Manchester United they faced Real Madrid then Barcelona they literally went past each one of them with these probably Real Madrid was the toughest and yeah they reached here and now they are in the Champions League final playing against PSG and have a look at their team guys such a strong team Lewandowski as striker, Ribery Robin as winger, Schweinsteiger Müller and Lahm formed the midfield, Alaba, David Luiz and I think that was Rafinha at right back, Dante as the centre back and also Manuel Neuer as goalkeeper, very strong team and our team is also very strong, Mark Andre Ter Stegen the goalkeeper, Alban Danilo the fullbacks, Benatia Silva the defence, Yaya Toure, Matic, Pjanic are the midfield, Royce, Ibrahimovic and Felipe Anderson form the attack, a really strong team and as you can see guys, Benatia is playing against his former team in the finals of the Champions League. And as you can see guys, they have the first attack of this game. It's Frank Ribery with the ball. He puts in a really good ball but gets deflected to Schweinsteiger who gets his header but gets to the ball but his header is wide. 12 minutes gone, it's still nil-nil. That was a very good chance for Bayern Munich but they couldn't take it. Now we have a chance here. It's Yaya Toure. 27 minutes into the game, it's still, it's now Marco Royce, he plays it to Zlatan Ibrahimovic, Zlatan plays it to Toure, Toure with the ball, Toure plays it back to Zlatan, Toure is making the run, Zlatan plays it to Yaya Toure, Yaya Toure shoots but Yaya Toure couldn't get it on target and Yaya Toure has been bossing the midfield and up till now, he's been really, he's been playing really well and still playing well, 34 minutes gone, it's still nil-nil, now we have a chance yet, uh, Jordi Alba who plays it to Matic, Matic shoots and deflection, that could have gone anywhere, but the keeper managed to get to it. Obviously, it is Manuel Neuer. Now, in the second half, we are, as you can see, they have a chance here. It's Schweinsteiger. Now, it's Lam. Lam plays it to Muller. Muller plays it back to Lam, and Lam with a golden chance, but he misses. How lucky are we? That was a great chance for Lam, but luckily, he did miss that. Now, we are still in this game, but now, unfortunately, Marco Royce is injured. That means we need to bring someone else on, and it's Raheem Sterling. Can he be the hero, guys? Really disappointed that Marco Royce is not going to be playing. Also, I'm going to be playing Raheem Sterling at left wing to see what he can do. I know this is not the time to experiment, but I don't I don't have any other choice. And as you can see, they do have a chance here yeah, as the ball falls to Robin, who plays it to Schweinsteiger, who wallies it, but what a save by Mark andre Ter Stegen. That was outstanding. That was out of this world. That was astonishing. I can't describe that. Have a look at it, guys. I don't know how did he manage to get to it. That was just wonderful stuff from him. Now we have a chance here. It's Philippe Anderson. Now it's Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Oh, what a ball to Raheem Sterling. Can he win the Champions League for us? It's Raheem Sterling. And how did he miss that? Oh, my words. This this guy can't finish at all. And I just don't know how did he miss that. That was probably one of the most easiest chances you can get in the Champions League final. But now we have a chance here. It's Matt Pjanic. Jumps past two players. But Dante gets to it. But still, guys, the attack is on. It's Yaya Toure with the ball. It's still Yaya Toure. Oh, look at that turn from Yaya Toure. Now it's Pjanic. Now it's Latan. Can he do something? It's Latan Ibrahimovic. And Ibrahimovic scores in the final of the Champions League. And that to the final minute of this game. We won't have to be going to extra time. The game should be over by now. And look at that, guys, from Zlatan Ibrahimovic. The number 10. Oh, my God. This guy is just amazing. He scores the most important goal of this series against Bayern Munich wonderful stuff from him and that's guys it's over we have we are champions league winners and yeah that's just amazing the champions of europe and wow look at that lamps disappointed but our players are really happy with this it's, it's just wonderful to see all the fans celebrate and yeah just look at that Ibrahimovic, Matic, Philippe Anderson I think that's Benatia yeah all celebrating and Bayern players are, aren't happy at all but what a win look at these players sliding I hope next year they put some more different kind of celebrations because it gets repetitive and it's not fun yeah you don't watch these celebrations and as you can see guys the captain is Thiago Silva and he's gonna be lifting the trophy for us wow it's wonderful look at all these players looking you know, they're looking really happy even Royce is now back on and jumping around after he got injured now it's Thiago Silva is gonna lift it he's coming quite slowly and 
he's shaking hands with that guy there and now he's gonna lift the trophy and there it is he's receiving it Thiago Silva is re receiving the trophy and Thiago Silva lifts it we are now champions of Europe wow what an achievement this is we have literally won everything to win in this series we have won the Coupe de Ligue we have won the Champions League we have won the league uh we have won the trophy this show probably the only trophy left was the uh, Copa Nacionale but anyways as you can see Mark Andre Ter Stegen is the man of the match of this game he was wonderful in this game especially that save from Bastian Schweinsteiger as well that I, I won't forget that that was just amazing stuff from him and as you can see guys we're champions of Europe and I think PSG should now hire me because I did it with these now we are now champions of Europe wow and this took two seasons to you know win everything we can and yeah we have done it we have accomplished what we had to do and I'll show you guys how our, 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 was our group stage you know assigned so we had a pretty easy group we got through Valencia then we also got through Locomotive and I actually I think we lost against Locomotive once but you know it was really fun our group and Valencia and us got through and as you can see guys we have won one league title one domestic cup and a continental cup which is obviously the Champions League our biggest win against Estac Troye our loss biggest loss against Bordeaux 3-1 the biggest win was 6-0 and as you can see we cut transfer fee 70 million euros and you know I've I think earned in this game 3.5 million which is good to see and we have played 111 games won 73 drawn 22 lost 16 scored 191 goals and conceded 81 goals a lot of goals conceded though but yeah, it's still fine 111 games 73 won a great record and that's basically guys the end of this series nothing more left i hope you guys have enjoyed the series as much as i have if you guys have don't forget to leave a like subscribe for more content and i will see you guys in my next video